Hello. Can anybody hear me out there? Hey, uh, welcome back to the Evil Within 2. I was just heading over to exit D5 to make our way to the business district, since we need to go secure the hotel. And this happened. Sykes? You're still in here? Are you okay? Sebastian, just the man I was looking for. But I'm okay, but I could really use your help back here. It'd be worth your while. Oh. I should probably go to his safe room and see what's going on. Oh, tons of goodies. I think my health is okay. Yep, we're maxed. This is not Sykes' safe house. Let me go save it real quick then. Just in case there's some nasty stuff on the way to the other safe house. <laughs> this looks different. Shit. That really is a stronghold. What's going on in there, Sebastian? STEM is going crazy. It seems like it's becoming even more destabilized. You don't know the half of it. I take it you had something to do with it? I wouldn't have done it if I didn't have to, Kidman. I'm gonna finish this once and for all. I'm gonna save Lily. And I have all the tools I need this time. Good luck, Sebastian. And keep me posted, okay? It's important that I know what's going on in there so that I can help you again. You get me? I do. I'll be in touch. Oh, hello. What the? They're killing each other? So is that killing them, or is it turning them into the fl- Oh, oh, it's on me. Oh, it's on me. Or it didn't? Kinda did. Alright, well it doesn't look like it turned them into the flaming ones. It's interesting. It's no longer nighttime. This is the first time it hasn't been- nighttime in an outdoor area. Everything looks so different. But yeah, one of those flamethrower people, I wonder if I can get their flamethrower fuels and use that to repair the weapon. Probably gonna come back around the corner. What if I should try shooting the tank? 
What if that'd be a weak point? Oh. God. You're still alive? He will lead us. Oh my god. I wonder if I can sneak kill them at all. They seem so strong, I'd be surprised if I could. Let's see. Oof. You're not even dead. Are you a boss? That's like straight up a repeat of the boss. I, I thought it would be a lower version of the boss, but it seems to be just as strong. Christ. Okay, let's try again. This time I'm gonna try stealth. Like, it didn't look like I could do a stealth kill before, but I'm gonna try it again anyway. And I also wanna try shooting them in the tank. Maybe with the sniper rifle. I'm sure it's not gonna kill them though, no way, right? Yeah. I'm glad that doesn't reach me. Oh. <laughs> I'm not getting the predator ability. Shit. Yeah, I'm not getting the predator ability to pop up. Oh shit! Do they see me? Oh 
wouldn't be surprised if it takes three or four stealth hits to kill it, but given how much ammo is expending on it, it's worth it. I think it's coming back this way, yep. Hopefully I'm faster this time. Nope. Nah. that one in. Yep, still not dead. You do not heed his call. I'm sorry, Father. I'm lost. I'm just gonna hide in this bush. Right, so I know for a fact they're gonna go to the other place and then they're gonna do their thing and they're gonna turn right around. So I'm just gonna like hide here. again. I, I don't understand, like why am I not getting a prompt for stealth? I get it sometimes and other times I just don't. Alright, I'm gonna run back and go get some coffee. Try hiding out here. No, I'm gonna stay behind the tree. Not the best cover, for sure, but I need to be pretty close because they move pretty fast. Should come over here soon. Stealth works with his enemy is just like really bad. Yep. That's fine. That's fine.
Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, whatever. <laughs> Should I just shoot them? This is like working out so badly. Forgot to shoot the tank. Flamethrower fuel tank, yes! Uh, two of these would be sufficient to replace the tanks of an otherwise functional flamethrower. Just the component I need. Almost there. Just need one more. Yeah, I do not get stealth with these enemies at all. My god, it's like... Yeah, so you can't use the predator ability. You can use stealth kinda sometimes, but you can't use the ambush ability either. But you can use stealth sometimes when you're behind him, kinda, maybe. Occasionally. It's like, okay. That one took two stealth kills, some sniper shots, and a full mag. Full 30 shots of an assault rifle. With bullet cascade combo. The whole while. What the? Okay. Did the body just, like, disappear? And I teleported? I don't really know what happened there. Alright. Let's take out some flaming dudes. You know, those things look like they would explode with coldness. I'd rather just use stealth, of course. I don't want to waste rounds. Let me see if there's anything new in here. Aha! Yeah, it seems like everything's been refreshed with new items. <laughs> Five high-grade weapon parts. If only, if only I could convert them into normal grade weapon parts. Like one turns into a hundred normal parts or something like that. That one's enjoying the fence. Please don't start flaming. Please don't start flaming. Oh, fuck. Hold on. Hold on. Go. Oh, shit. Can't see me. Can't see me.
I don't even want to kill that one. It's having so much fun. I'm gonna leave it. Another one of those big ones. to explore the entire map again. Sweet. I thought maybe the other one was joining. It's not. Is there something in that car? Oh, Christ. Is it going to jump out of the car? So I'm supposed to be going to the hotel, right? That's here. Yeah, but I want to explore the whole map. So I'm just going to go wherever. I don't know, I'll, I'll just start going this way, go towards the theater. I want supplies. Let's see if the box on the roof here is refreshed. Bottle. Oh. There. I'm scared every time I see a pile of bodies. I'm scared that it's gonna rearrange itself into one of those flesh beasts. Oh, even the vending machine is back? Thanks. for it. It is, it is. Okay. Well, hello, Love for Dead. even gonna find automatic rifle ammo in the wild. Might have to just craft it. Might take this one out while I'm back here.
Uh oh. Oh, we're good. Whew. It's probably going to catch on fire when it comes around, right? What do you bet? Mm -hmm. Oh! Get it to see me. That's alright, I didn't intend to come back here anyway. Just wanted to take him out while it was easy. Man, they're really just giving you tons of stuff, huh? Well, maybe not ammo, but at least uh, weapon parts and stuff like that. Like, getting 70 in a pile that's just strewn about randomly, that is very uncommon. Ooh! There's another flamethrower, and they're ironically in a puddle of something that I could catch on fire, but what would be the point? I imagine they're resistant to flame. They're also being a little bit weird. I don't know if there's a safe way to get to him. I'm just going to come at that from a different angle. I really don't want to take this one out. It's having so much fun. Oh, well. Oh, it's on me. Oh, that wasn't the one having fun. Good. <laughs> Flamethrower should be somewhere over here. I try to go for stealth kills. I mean, I really don't want to use too much ammo on it. I'm just gonna go for it. Okay. One out of at least three. Oh, I'm dead. I 
I hate these enemies so much. <laughs> All right, I made back most of my progress and also saved it, so if I die, I shouldn't lose too much. Let's try this. I don't see how that could have missed. Much better. Now, I want to test my assumption. Well, it's not really an assumption, but it seemed like I wasn't able to do an ambush. Let me just try that again. Maybe I can. I'm pretty sure I can. Nope, definitely can. I hate this game. <laughs> yes, cover up. Cover up my shame. I don't want to see it. This is the stupidest enemy. My god, I hate it. I loathe everything about it. It's terrible. It was good as a boss fight, but as a general enemy, it's just terrible. The only thing I can think of... That's messing up my stealth. Because if you notice, I kept approaching and then it would just turn around as if it could see behind itself. The only thing I can think of is perhaps it has superhuman hearing more than any, uh, literally any other enemy I've encountered. And so it can actually hear me when I'm sneaking up behind it. Maybe I should take the next level of low profile. Yeah, they're actually pretty cheap. I can get both. Low profile 2 and 3. Alright, let's try it. Okay. Rip my ammo. Yeah, forget stealth on them, my god. Low profile didn't do anything. That's it. The last piece I need. Ah. <sighs> I think every enemy in this game has been pretty fun to fight, except for those two. Anyway, let's go compile it. Compile it. Repair it. And hopefully I can drink some coffee too. Ooh, ooh, look at that! That's perfect. You may very well be the best detective. Thank you, Tatiana. You seem so excited. So I need 100,000 to get the very top reward. I got 136,300 weapon parts. All right. Let's cobble together that flamethrower and then see what we can upgrade. This odd weapon can be used to quickly fill an area with flaming liquid. It is heavy and cumbersome enough to restrict movement. Fuel will be loaded into the flamethrower immediately upon crafting. Q will store the flamethrower on your back, allowing you to move more freely. I'm trying to think of how I would want to use this. A slow, heavy, cumbersome weapon. I don't know, slow is usually not good. It has its own special key, like Q, just for the flamethrower to store it on the back. It says fuel be loaded immediately upon crafting. What does that mean? Like, does that mean I can't craft ammo for it? Or what? Uh, oh. Okay, so you can. It just comes loaded. Hmm. Interesting. Well, I've got, like, no ammo. I guess I'll just craft as many handgun shots as I can. Yeah, it looks like you can't even upgrade it, which is good. I don't think it'd be worth... Upgrading, I don't think it's something you're going to use very often. I'm 
tempted to upgrade the firepower of this because, again, it's like a super boss weapon, I would think. But I don't have any ammo for it, and so far I haven't really found any. So, I don't know. Let's see what my alternatives are. 10% more damage with that. I've already got the crit. That's 800. Um, what about this? Oh yeah, somebody mentioned the reason... Um, the reason that this damage increase may be so small, with each one only giving you, what, 5%, 5%? Yes, each one only gives you a 5% damage increase, which seems really paltry, but... They pointed out that the shotgun fires a bunch of different shots all at the same time. So perhaps the damage increase is per pellet. So a 5% damage increase actually might equal much more than it seems. I think I'm gonna get this crit too. 20% to 40% chance of a crit. Can I afford the next one here? 200? Oh, I can. Alright, let's get this next damage. Alright, I want to try out the flamethrower just a little bit, just to see how it works, but I've got some enemies to take out here. Sebastian, please don't burn yourself. Oh. I've also got the big one over here. Gotta take that out again. I'm pretty sure it just kind of stays there. Got the run of this place now. And that's just a bottle, don't worry. Alright, let's equip it. I'm gonna put it on six. I'm gonna put the bottle on seven. Oh, yeah, you really can't move fast. So, right click does nothing. Q to stow it on your back. So, Q stows it on your back, and then if you right click, then it takes it back out. As opposed to switching weapons, which I think accomplishes the same thing, really. Yeah, you can also just switch weapons. Okay, I'm gonna fire it just once. Ooh, look at that. So I think each bit of fuel actually becomes a flame, doesn't it? Like, on the ground? For a brief moment? Cool. Alright, well I'm definitely gonna save that for a boss. Also, I want that thing off my back, because it is huge. Get that thing off of there. There we go. Oh, forgot to grab this. This is the, what, like 50? 70, right. You can do it.
Oh, yeah. That's right. I was going to Sykes' place. I forgot. That's right there. Well, let's check in. You're here. Good. What's going on, Sykes? I'm sort of busy here. Hey, you're the one who told me to call you before I left. You found your back door. Check it out. Congrats. You'll have to show me how to use it if I need to get Lily out later. Fair enough, but here's the deal. I'm gonna need you to help me get out of here first. Help you? I don't know anything about how these computers work, Sykes. That's not what I need help with. I hacked the servers to access a restricted area of STEM. There's a pod in there that I'm gonna use to get out of here. Problem is, the power's out. And there are a bunch of those things in there too. Damn collapse is affecting the deepest parts of STEM. You get the power back on and clear the place out for me, I can get the hell out of here. Again, what's in it for me? I'll show you how to use the pod before I go. How's that? Okay. Worth a try, I guess. Thanks, man. Call me when it's all clear. I gotta tell you, I was surprised to hear from you. Tell me about it. I've been lying low to solve this back door thing, but I stuck my head out there a few times. Things are going nuts. What's happening out there? There's a maniac who's trying to take over Union. You were smart to stay in here. Otherwise, you might have ended up flayed and tortured. Sounds grim. I think I'll pass. What's worse is that the guy wants to get his hands on Lily. Well, if this plan works out, you'll be able to get her to safety once you find her. How did a guy like you end up in Mobius in the first place? A guy like me? What are you trying to say? I'm saying that you've got heart and a backbone. Seems they prefer their operatives to be either cold reptiles or unquestioning followers. You're neither. What did you think I meant? Uh, nothing. Never mind. You know, I actually searched them out to try and join. Wasn't easy either. They know how to hide their tracks. Why would you do that? They're only the most powerful organization in the history of the world, dude. Why wouldn't I? And you don't consider what they do to be criminal? Hey, it's only criminal when it's enforced. You know what they say. Quis custodiat, ipsos custodes. Right? Uh, sure. I'll... I'll take your word for it. <laughs> Well, on that note, I think that's a pretty good place to end this episode. So, tell me. Whoops. So, I hope you've enjoyed so far. And when I return, I guess I'm going to help Sykes out and go into the Marrow Experimental Wing. <laughs>